you know sit over there and you're... You know what does support it? Bras. It? Uh. <coughs> Hi. <laughs> Welcome to your poor podcast. I'm Marcus. I'm Kara. <laughs> I'm Natasha. And I am Vox. <laughs> and I started this day off with puns. <laughs> puns? Puns. What was that word that I made up in the car the other day? <laughs> I don't know. That that's. Oh, I told him that he couldn't make our children's names punable. punable. Yeah, punable. Like, what uh, was the name we were talking about? I don't remember. I don't know, but I don't want to. I don't want to relive great. that conversation. No, those are funny. <laughs> but great. I told him that he can't pick our kids' names to be like. You can't make puns out of them. Why? Oh, oh, it's awful. Because I told her. I told her I kind of wanted to name a kid Achilles, and. She's like, you're being a pain in the pain in the ass. And uh, she's like, what do we say for short? I'm like, I don't know, Lee's, <laughs> ache. And then I'm like, you're being an ache in my ass. <laughs> yeah. Isn't there? Yeah. Like, Where's your soundboard <laughs> and the cricket button? <laughs> <laughs> I can't do it. Wind, I have wind one. whistling. <laughs> you hear a tumbleweed. I don't think this is gonna work with it. But I do have one, and it's in the making. You keep right saying now. that, but nobody believes you. Yeah. It's fine. Not us, not it's the fine. listeners. I, can't. I haven't seen it's, it. It's so going to be like the YouTube guys. It. It's going to be like the YouTube. You. He's saying it's coming, and then when it shows up, we'll be surprised. Listen, <laughs> it's all on the computer, which I don't have because I'm in the middle of moving things. So what's going to be your excuse in a couple months? Nothing, because the studio. Will be I built just in the moved basement. into this house. What do you expect? <laughs> <laughs> Calm down. I haven't unpacked yet. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> it's on the computer. <laughs> it's on my laptop. I'll be able to just plug my laptop right in. We'll have them all. Speaking okay. of plugging in, uh, I'm going to do some plugs. Boo. <laughs> Please plug visit in, our, our website in. at tf4podcast.com. You can listen and download episodes, check out our blog posts and updates, as well as some tidbits about us. Tidbits. Yep. You can also find our episodes on your go-to podcast apps, including iTunes, Podcast Addict, CastBox, and Podbean. Pretty much everything except Spotify and iHeartRadio even though that's my favorite. Please subscribe and leave us a review and rating. It's a great way to help us help support us for free. Uh, it goes a long way towards promoting us and give, having us gain popularity. Having us? Helping us gain popularity. I can't speak. It's fine. Uh, you can also find us on Facebook by searching for TF4 Podcasts. We post weekly updates and share our episodes. Drop us a like and a follow. Yeah, and stay connected. For when we make new posts. Get connected. <laughs> I'm terrible for today. Free. The for fuck is wrong with me? Connection. What the fuck is wrong with Not you? Not sponsored. Get connected. Next. I'm confused. Wait, are we talking about the MTV show now? Because that it's was not good. A show, I it. It's a commercial. Next was a good show. Oh, I thought you were talking about the education <laughs> connection that we were talking about. <laughs> we could talk about Are You the oh, One? You threw my phone on the floor. There it went. Uh, if you're interested in owning some of your very own podcast merch, check us out on Redbubble. We currently have stickers, mugs, phone cases available, uh, possibly dildos. We don't know yet. Woohoo! Every purchase, <laughs> every purchase goes toward uh, supporting us and our growth. We appreciate you guys making our logo. Ma I keep saying making, rocking our logo day to day. <laughs> <laughs> Car head box are dying right now. I'm sorry. I'm bombing. This is the very f distant. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> it's like like Homer Simpson found a fucking donut. <laughs> mm, forbidden dildo. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we finally launched our YouTube channel. We will be posting all we future really episodes. <laughs> They'll be available to listen to. Just search for TF4 Podcast, like, and subscribe. Uh, we discovered last week that... It's not that easy. It's very. It, is, it is now. It was. It is now. It, okay. Yeah. So it was uh, difficult to find it under under just searching. The way that the reason why it wasn't searching is because there was no videos. So it was oh. like the channel was just null. Oh, okay. So. Easy breezy. Beautiful. You should be able to just search under the channel yeah, though. Okay. That's the weird thing. Yeah. Well, guess what? You can. You can now. Um. Okay. So and of course, if you enjoy us so much that you would like to help us financially, you can become a patron at patreon.com to search for tf4 podcast and you'll see a variety of reward tiers where we give you awesome stuff in exchange for your support shout out to our uh, current patrons the patrons dustin and steve hi they're awesome hi, hi. and helping us out um don't watch any of those videos because i, I want to i'm not going to okay because there's zero views on all of them but i want to actually track the people that are watching i'm oh going to watch God. them all seven times <laughs> oh, don't do that 
Um, story time. I have a hole in my hand. Nah. I, have to, I have to get this off my chest real fast. Yeah, you're the one that inspired this. Yeah, take that shirt off. Cut. <laughs> get naked. For free. <laughs> <laughs> At Natasha's apartment. Okay. <laughs> you're, you're all done. Give me this. <laughs> it's not even open. I know. Oh, shorty's in the club. Let me see your chest. <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> I meant to mention this a couple of weeks ago because it's been an ongoing thing, but today was a very sad day. Yes. Um, so I rescued a spider mm. out of the bathroom and Tosh didn't know this because it was a pretty big spider. So now you know it was in your apartment, but <laughs> um, she built a, n- a web, a nest, I almost said, but a web in the corner of the balcony and has been like living there. The thing that I was sitting next to out there? Yes. Okay. That big web that's there? Yeah. Yeah. Um, and there was like eggs and stuff, but there was no bugs going up there. So the eggs died. But she's still been like chilling. So today I went out there and I like sat in the chair. And then when I put like across my leg when I sit because it's comfortable. And when I pulled my foot up, there was a flattened spider on my heel. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. I can't. <laughs> and I, I named her Charlotte. Char- Charlotte accordingly, of course. Oh, but no. I fucking killed her. <laughs> 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 That's fucking great. I, I like, helped this bitch stay alive for, like, a month now, and then I <laughs> stepped on her. You're like, surprise, bitch. And how do you feel about this pet spider that he's had? It was, she was cute. I mean, it was nice she to was watch cute. her. Yeah, it was nice to watch her, like, build her web and do whatever she was doing. Mm-hmm. She did... There was one time Vox knocked her off of the balcony. Oh, and she I had a heart came, attack. And she came back up. And she I feel came terrible. Back to her web. <laughs> you guys are so dumb. I know. <laughs> it was our first. If we had known about the spider throughout the past month, it would be totally different. But just listening. <laughs> <laughs> it was our first pet together. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sad. You guys are stupid. She's very <laughs> special. <laughs> So sad. It was a little fucking like garden spider. Relax. It, it, she was pretty big. Did you look up what kind it was? No, she, she then was. Then you didn't care that much. <laughs> wow. I shouldn't have to know what kind of You she know, is. there is one person out there that would really appreciate this, and it's my dad. He would love hearing your story. Alex he's, probably would too. He's caught so many spiders, but he does like a, a bad thing with them where he like has this <laughs> oh, container. Arena pit fighting. Yeah. <laughs> he finds bigger spiders <laughs> oh and he puts them God. in there and then the biggest one survives. Well, not no always shit. the biggest well, one. Well, sometimes, yeah. Whichever one survives stays in there until the, he finds another spider. No, Tony oh and God. I. <laughs> <laughs> Tony and I were uh, messaging today and I he was saying, it was either today or today, regardless. Um, he was saying that he found a spider on him in his bed and he, and I was like, did you say hello? And like, pick it up and like, take it outside so it could live a prosper, you know? No, he fucking no, killed it. I he bet. he probably fucking killed yeah, it. Like goes, a normal fucking human being. He goes, this spider said bye bye. And I was like, oh, and then I told him like, Hey, I saved a spider and, and I he killed and, it and like then, a fucking murderer. And then I, wa- I texted him immediately cause I was going to, here's how I found out that, sh- that, this whole planned out because I went out there and I was going to take a picture to send to Tony. And oh then, no. And, he, and she wasn't there, but it was raining and she usually goes down when it rains. So I was like, okay. So I sat down and then that's when I picked up my leg and I was like, ah! <laughs> I was like maybe it wasn't her. <laughs> she ain't there yet. It's been, I've been home since fucking five o'clock. I was looking Absolutely. around for a spider when I saw that web over there. I'm like, she, there's, I don't see it. That web is now an empty home. It started as just <laughs> like a, a simple web, and then she kept going and going and yeah. going. So I, was like, I love I that you just you just raised her up for slaughter. It's pretty great. Oh. <laughs> I mean, it is it is really sad. I needed that, you that worked laugh. So hard Thank with you. that spider <laughs> just to accidentally step on. When it. we were sitting out there before too, at night there was like a moth flying around, and I grabbed that fucking moth and stuck it on the web for her. Mm-hmm. Wow. <laughs> and now you, don't you know box. what? Did all the things I that bet we she try didn't to even get you to, to that moth because you killed it. All of the things we try to get you to care about, <laughs> and about then a there's a spider. spider. She was nice. Did yeah? Well, did she have a pet pet pig for a friend? Uh, maybe I don't know. I don't know what she does in Where's her spare time. Babe? Clearly, she didn't. She's living here. No. Oh no. That's, or wait, that's she movie. was living Wilbur. here. Wilbur. 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 <laughs> Wilbur is a completely different movie. Listen, if you want to know about spider stories, ask him. He knows all about them. Yeah. You should. You should have gotten her a friendly rat to play with. Ew. Templeton. 
He's not friendly. He wasn't friendly. I know. He's like, yeah, he's like kind of a dick. Templeton's an asshole. Yeah. Friendly. Car, car had a rat named Templeton, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Ooh, you had a rat? Mm-hmm. Did you kill You're it? You're ewing about that when you had a pet spider? <laughs> the pet spider was the size of a nickel, or a dime, not even a nickel. But that's, our rat, you I said did, it was pretty our rat big, would fit in big. my hoodie pocket I did play like with this. mice one time, and they were like crawling. There was two of them, and they were crawling on me. They were really cute. Car watched me kill baby mice. Same. <laughs> Yeah, I've also watched to kill, kill baby mice too. Was this at Blake's or something? Yeah, and I've killed baby mice myself because they're a nuisance. But well, well, we had destroyed a an mouse accident. nest, and the baby mice were just kind of like scattered around, and I had to put them. They out weren't going to survive. No, there was no way they were going to survive. <laughs> so but Kara watched me bludgeon of, them to death with a four by four. Not a not like a four wheeler. It was like a no like a, post, a four like by a wooden, four. A piece of like wood. A wooden oh, pole. I you just were like running it over with your truck. <laughs> nope, <laughs> nope, a piece of wood. Nope, he had like I a big thing into of wood, the and he gave just kind of like him a shallow burial. beat it's it fine. down into the ground. Oh. And then I thought you just like, hey, I'll take care of these <laughs> these mice and get in your truck. And <laughs> I wouldn't waste no. the gas. <laughs> Double tap. Oh god. Anyways, then, that was then my story. Then she found a third one, and I was like, all right, well, it's gonna meet his meet his siblings. It's fine. Oh god. Yeah. Um, who's next? we didn't find the parents. who's next? You said you had a hole. In I your had hand? a hole in my hand, man. I'm opening. Stabbed myself work today. Let me see. It's fine. He's just dumb. It doesn't look that bad. Let me see. No. Did it hurt? It, 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 looks it like hurt, hurt a lot. It was way. It looked way worse when that I first opened it up. Pretty bad. Oh, I. It's it's kind of sw- shut now, but like when it was open, I could actually see in there. It was gross. Can't like Mike's hard. It was with a. Uh, it was with a screwdriver. Mike's hard what? Lemonade. Oh. Okay. It's Red's wicked lemonade. Yeah. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, yeah. sorry. Mike's hard dick. He means. Um, it's better though. Yeah, it is better than Mike's hard dick. Yeah, cause, well, mm-hmm. you would hey, know. Stop it. <laughs> <laughs> I want to roll that. So, I, why did you stab yourself with the screwdriver? Complete accident. Shit happens. That's a boring story, Mark. I thought you were no, be like, right? I was hammering. There was a shit. lot of fucking blood. <laughs> no, he was trying to unwedge something or yeah, whatever, uh, had, and he was like, had a tool stuck in the tool body, and, and like, I was, I was forcing right it out. I was forcing it out like this, and then when it finally came loose. The whole tool body turned in my hand and it went uh. right into my hand. How was that? What was it? Oh. Uh. Yeah. Yeah. It's a great noise. <laughs> noise. It made a, it made a gross sound and then I had to pull the screwdriver out of my hand. Did you say, <laughs> ow, that hurt really bad? Fuck! Oh. <laughs> That's what I said. <laughs> Heavens forbid I stabbed myself <laughs> with a screwdriver. I literally yelled, motherfucker! <laughs> I'm in pain. Please went help full me. full on same L. Jackson at that screwdriver, even mm-hmm. though it was my fault. And then I had to wash the screwdriver off with alcohol because, you know. I didn't want anybody else to get my blood on them. Yeah, because you have AIDS. No, but I mean, all right. Herpes? Sure. Gonocephalitis? No. Yes. Okay. Now we're talking. <laughs> Speaking of gonocephalitis. I don't think there was any STDs involved. But you never know. <laughs> but, uh... We're talking about Kara's ex? What? What? Hmm? I was just trying to make a clever joke. It wasn't very clever. It wasn't very clever. She's not I, am your ex. I think everybody exactly. in the world knows she that, like... Have an ex. I mean, I have exes, but they weren't like legit exes. Ex. They were like high school exes. <laughs> yeah. No, I'm talking about the other event that happened. The uh, the oral misconduct or whatever you want to call this. It's Is that an actual thing? I don't know. Oh. Sexual misconduct <laughs> out in public. I, I think I don't think oral it's misconduct. sex in public. Yeah, I don't think it's mis. Conduct if the other person oral willing. misconduct is. I don't know. It's too willing. Doing parties. it in public is misconduct. Yeah, I guess you're right. Or. Disorderly, I don't know what you want to call it. It was bad. Um, so some people came in looking for jobs, and one of the people <laughs> they was got already, a job already. So they actually called our office because <coughs> one person, one of the two, was already registered with our office. Um, and he was like, hey, my girlfriend really wants a job, so can I bring her up there? And he brought her up for a job, for sure. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so they, they pulled up in the parking lot, and uh, they backed their car into the space. So that the front of their vehicle is facing directly into the window of the room where Jessica and I normally sit. So Jessica's got a full on view out the window to <coughs> them in the front seat kissing and um, like hugging each other and stuff. Mouth hugs. And then uh, her, she disappeared for a minute. Um, for just a minute. Yeah, she just disappeared for a minute. <laughs> Ponytail bouncing um, and everything. And then she got up and she... Wiped she, her like, mouth. She, he got she, up she, No, she like actually. sat up in her seat and turned so that she was like facing him in the seat. And then she went back down. <laughs> I love the arm movement. And she was gone for a little bit. Um, and then uh, Jessica <laughs> pulled our other coworker in 
And Jerry came in and he was like, all right, I'm going to go home for the day. Um, <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> Bye. And then they got up. They got out of the car. It was only like, I guess it was only a couple minutes that this was going on. Swooshed with some water. Gurgled <laughs> no, and spit. No, no, got up. Got out of the car. She went to kiss him. He leaned away from her. Oh. And then he, they were walking towards the building, and he reached into his pants to readjust himself because you could very cle- clearly see everything that was going on there. He uh, readjusted himself, and they walked in, and she asked for an application. <laughs> I'm glad that you made that very clean because you could have been a mark and been like, she was slobbing on his knob and had jizz on her chin or something. I mean, you just did it for me, but <laughs> she didn't have all that stuff going on. There was a point where we, we had an idea of what she would be a good fit for. and Blowjobs. No, she had, we had an idea what she would be a good fit for. and The red light? Um, another of my coworkers <laughs> didn't really know the full extent of what was going on because she was in there, so we couldn't really tell him. And... Uh, we had to do a drug screen for her, which is an oral screen where you have to like put this cotton Gross. swab in your mouth. And I forgot all like, about that. And he was like, she wasn't like, it wasn't working because her mouth was dry. Um, so he was like, Hey, do you want like a glass of water or something like that? And she's like, no, my mouth is really gross right now. And we were all like, Oh no, <laughs> no. Then drink the water. Right. <laughs> so then she, uh, she, she somehow figured out the drug screen. They got that sorted out, and then she was like, "Can I use your bathroom?" And she's doing a little. <laughs> All right, let's get it wet. Oh. <laughs> it was bad. All I can imagine. So he he became aware that we kind of knew what had happened because Jessica had to talk to him and be like, "Listen, I, like professionally speaking, like that wasn't very professional." Because you guys parked right in front of my window. Like, that's all she said. And he was like, oh, I know what you're talking about. Like, he made it clear that he understood what was going on. She's like, I can't I can't have you guys work together knowing that, you know, you guys go on break together. Yeah. So she just, le- that she just like, left it at that. And he he moved on. Like, they, they we found other options for both of them to satisfy them. Oh, <laughs> more than she could, yeah, obviously. When, when Cara, when Cara <sighs> told me about it, I literally responded, well, at least we know she's good at one job. Yeah. God. Yeah, I don't think that he told her though that we knew. He did not tell her because well, she didn't seem like she admitted her mouth was. She would have been. She would have been embarrassed. I I think, and yeah. uh, we didn't. We didn't want yeah, her to no feel shit, that way. Really. So. Well, she should be embarrassed. I I just find that so. What are you doing? I find that so he seemed gross. very confident though when he was like, "Yeah, I know what you're talking about." Like he, of course, he got he his like, dick sucked. Like, <laughs> you don't need to. Elaborate was he going to be that? embarrassed by the fact that he had a, a mouth around his wiener? Like. No, <laughs> fuck it. I guess anyone uh, with a wiener enjoys that. Yeah, it was <laughs> guaranteed. Yes, it was, a, it was an interesting day. It was an interesting day to say the least. Do you guys have any discriminations against that? Like personal, not like professional. oral sex in public. Yes, I love it. I don't care. <laughs> I wouldn't do it the way that they did it. I not would be more yeah. like private. At least be a little it. more discreet. Yeah. Or on the highway, whatever. At night. Yeah. See, I don't. F- okay. Well, highway. That's. I think that's a little more. That's not necessarily public. It, it is. is public, I guess. But that, I'm like, I'm not thinking that oh, I'm driving on the highway in public. Like, <laughs> that's not something that comes to mind. But in public, I'm thinking like, in a park, or in a store, or yep. in a mall, yep. or what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Don't look at me. Don't look at her. Okay. I didn't say I, I didn't say specifically I've done it in all of those places, but I'm saying Oh, oh, okay. Uh, yeah. I was gonna say you yeah. have to remember though, he was engaged to a slut, so yeah, this is true. <laughs> whoa, wow. Yeah, true. Do you <laughs> you're like, whoa, yeah, yeah, <laughs> true. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> I had to think about it for a second, I'm like, Yeah, yeah. Um, where else could they do it? Uh movie in, theater? A, in a movie theater. Behind the bushes no. in a park the first time you meet someone. I could I, I couldn't do it park. in a movie theater. I don't uh, think I I've done stuff in a movie theater. God, yep. Mark. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yep. <laughs> High five. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> <laughs> We're sluts. <laughs> it was empty. <laughs> I don't yeah, care. True. I've, I've done it in a busy one, though, so that's fine. Same slut. <laughs> Same slut. <laughs> I'm really uncomfortable Dude, by that. It's no. I've never. I'm no. Yeah, no. I'd be very. I'm. I'm. I can't stop thinking about like all the jokes people make about like the floor being sticky, and I'm like, I would never want to contribute to that. Yep. I'd always feel like somebody's about to walk in and see what's happening. It just, I wouldn't want to make anybody uncomfortable. It's dark. Nobody no. sees anything. No, and yeah. if they do, they plus they're, they're I, go, I only go to the movies. I only sucks. pay to go in to watch a movie I actually want to see. Yeah. So why would I waste my time? Yeah. 
I don't think I, I went think. into the uh, and mind you I'm a I'm a big Will Ferrell fan but uh, Blades of Glory is arguably his worst movie got a blowjob during it it's fine movie was alright still pretty alright Mark I don't remember <laughs> what movie it was <laughs> you weren't watching it <laughs> that memorable so (laughs) yeah yeah you're gonna need a little bit of that (laughs) i didn't know that we're sluts mark was mark was young though he was like Uh, like 16 sure wasn't like 16 sure yeah i think i was 18 whore 23 whatever (laughs) kidding i was 16 (laughs) 23 16 17 22 and a um, half. <laughs> anyways, I just, I don't know. I just don't think that that's good. <laughs> Whatever. And I think I, wait, I messaged a little bit, but total premise, no, no no offense in this corner, but I just think it's so trashy. Yeah. I do. I just think it's so. Yep. Like, that's supposed to be like an intimate, like, thing, but you know? I mean, that's oh. the thing, though, when you're in. I mean, sometimes it's just a dirty, fun thing to do, so. When you live with your parents. There's only a few options exactly. that you have. Exactly, she's dead on, and yes, it's trashy. And that, let me tell you, let me tell you this: the, my ex and I, one of the first times we went to a movie together, she went in to the theater like w- w- like we bought our movie tickets and everything, and she went to the bathroom. She came back out wearing a skirt. What the fuck? Let me tell you, she had some intentions. She did clearly. Yeah. Yeah, she came back out with just the skirt. Why didn't no, she I mean, wear a skirt to the well, movies? On the bottom. There was, oh, I was going to say, on there the was a top. Area. Yeah, there was a but top. But I mean, like, <laughs> sh- woo <woo-hoo>. Yeah. <laughs> Titties flopping around when she walks in the movie theater. Okay, what about what about doing something, like, in an area that you're, clo- like, around your friends? It, around my friends? Yeah. I don't think so. Like, never, like, so. at your friend's house or around them, like... No. Co-ed sleepover kind of thing. <laughs> I've never been to a co-ed sleepover. My friend, we went to... I've done it. <laughs> Natasha's like, uh... Natasha and I are both sluts. Yeah. It's fine. I've done M- it. Vox knows this I'm not story. an innocent on this I one. I do? Yes. That's, not, that's true. You aren't. Are you sharing with the, the audience or no? Um, I don't <laughs> think so. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> we, were at, we were in the same hotel room, and there was a bed next to like us. Like with other people That's a good stuff? party. Yeah. I was at my friend's house. I don't know if I know that yes, story. Yes, you do. Okay. Well, we'll see. Kalahari. Yeah. Oh, man, fuck you. Well, bringing that up on the show. She asked if there was any time when friends were there. You're right. I do know about that story. Yeah. <laughs> was it you? Fuck no. Oh. <laughs> no, Vox is too private for that. Yeah. I just thought it was you. Way so too you private. And I would never, ever go to Kalahari with her friends. Sorry, guys, if you're listening, but I'm not going to do that. That's fine. With her friends or your friends? Or any friends. I don't really have friends besides you two. So, wow. would Mormon. you go to Kalahari with us? What's Kalahari? I forgot. It's a water, it's a water, park. Park. Like a water park. I mean, oh. I got Tony, park. but he lives in fucking. Isn't that the one that's like Grey Wolf Traverse Lodge City? or something like, like that? Michigan yeah, there's Outdoor a Adventures swim up shit. bar. There's a hot tub that's outdoors. It's we should really go to fun. Kalahari, Mark. Yeah. Yeah. We'll go. Do it at the hot tub. But uh, but no, no, and no. I'm never, I'm never going to do it in a hot tub. Again? You mean never? We never have. That sounds awful, too, because there's a lot of bacteria kind of in have, that yeah. hot water. Mm-mm. It wasn't a hot tub, per se, but it was a jacuzzi tub in a in a but there's a lot of, but there's Oh, that was different. We weren't in the water. For we that were stuff. in the water. It was different. It's not like a, like a cesspool for germs where it's like a public jacuzzi <laughs> kind of thing. This was Why do like we always get back to the sex topics on this show? Mark, <laughs> Listen, have I, I have your topic? written consent did, that you were fine what? with talking about sex today. About arguing oral sex in public, not <laughs> our sexual experiences. And, and Tosh followed that up with, oh, great, it's going to be another sex episode. No, and you fine. did not deny I said it. Sex I said it's, <laughs> it's fine, Mark. We can go back to blowjobs. I've done that with my friends sleeping in the bed not near me. It was bad. Yep. It was, it was, yep. What, what friend? <laughs> Somebody friend who's not, not my friend, a friend anymore. anymore. Oh, no. Not because of that. Oh. Because she's <laughs> a bigger slut. <laughs> a bigger slut? A bigger slut. He called you a slut. He yeah. did, even though he was the person it was with. Yes. Whores. <laughs> All of yep. you are whores. You're all going to hell. Prude. What, what's so, Prude. So, shame. So? So? <laughs> I'm going to go to heaven. Wait, what was your question? Tosh. Yeah, what's your question? I said, have you ever in a hot tub? In a hot tub? No. Okay. It's just it's so dirty. It's like yeah. Bacteria flowing into Never you. Never in a hot tub. You have tub. an there's open like, hole in your body. there's like the room, like 
there's like a the tub in your room that can be like a jacuzzi tub. It was a jacuzzi tub. tub. That's tub. different. Yeah, oh, was, that's different. That was a lot of fun. Yeah, yeah, that's different. That's pretty fun. Um, really I mean, messy though. We have holes that bacteria can swim in too. So, yeah. so do they? I, that's what I'm saying. Like how dirty. Yeah. And they, and they always say like hot tubs <laughs> are like nasty as fuck. Anyways. Whatever. I yeah. love hot tubs. That's why you don't go underwater in hot tub. You get pink eye. I do go underwater in hot tubs. I just don't open my eyes because I'm not stupid. Yeah. You still get pink eye with closed eye. I've never gone pink water, eye man. and I've gone under hot tubs almost every time I've gone in a hot tub. Same. Wow. I've gotten pink eye before, but never from that. I don't think I've gone like into the water in a hot tub like fully submerged. I, I always I've do. That. I've gone down to like my shoulders and stuff because my neck, but I've never put my head under the water. Hot tubs just make me uncomfortable because... I like like hot showers and I like swimming in warm water, but if it's boiling my skin, it's not that hot though. It's only 104 degrees. I have sensitive skin. He's got sensitive sensitive nipples. It's it's literally meant to soothe your body. Yeah, it's not as bad as you think. Maybe you've been in the wrong hot tubs, but you don't like step in and you're like ah my skin. Like, do you go in a sauna and complain about it being hot? No, I would never go into a sauna. Oh. Into a sauna. He's like, I don't want to like sweat by choice. <laughs> yeah, that's great. terrible. It was awesome. We did. They, they open all your pores. They kind of make yeah. your body feel like it's breathing. Well, at Trump Tower, they have like a my, my skin sauna. Is they had a sauna and a steam room. You went to Trump Tower. That's where we stayed. Dear Lord. It was awesome. It's such a nice hotel. Uh huh. So you expect like any different him, from my boy? But it was beautiful. Our view was awesome. Service was great. Bed, beds were comfortable. Listening, listening. Trump's a badass. Showers were awesome. Shit. There was a shower in the gym, or not in the gym, but it was in like the spa or whatever where the steam room and the sauna was. And it came down like it was like raining, like the shower. And then it came out like three ways towards you. And then there was a detachable shower, shower head too. Cool. It was awesome. Oh, that sounds like the really amazing place that I went to in Canada that wasn't owned by Trump. So I guess those exist too. Yeah. Fuck. Yeah. Impossible. I have videos to prove it. Of the like what the bathroom looked Her like. Her place wasn't was also not in the middle of the city. It's and I had a fireplace better. in my my room. Yeah, mm. and a couch. That's Canadians for you, socialist bastards. Canadians do it things was a, It was a, a resort, so yeah. yeah. Um, what you, you got? You got other things to tell us? Yeah, but does us. Tasha have any stories? Oh yeah, sorry. <laughs> well, she said she didn't, so I kind of put that in the back of my head. Do I have any stories? No personal stories. You said that you hurt yourself on your guys' trip. How was your trip? Other than that? Oh That's yeah. That's a good story. <laughs> <laughs> we were so we were coming back from Howl at the Moon, which is a dueling piano bar. Love dueling pianos. It was so much fun. I th- if we have one out here, we should totally do it. There, there is, is one. one. Out here it's somewhere. like the B fifty like something Oak area, Troy area. Restaurant. Yeah, the, let's do it. It's out by the. It's out by that nightclub that we ran into you at. It's down the street from there, I think. Oh, Ferndale Orchid. Yeah, it's like down the street from there, I think. Oh, I forgot you guys ran into. It. I was like, yeah. when the fuck were like we down at the street from the and you ran into them? <laughs> Rachel's birthday. Yeah, I forgot about that. Um, and we went to Howl at the Moon, and I had a little bit too much to drink, and I was wearing heels. You? Yeah. Thank you. So I was wearing heels. No. And oh, no. I stepped, I guess I stepped on a crack. You broke your mother's back? <laughs> oh, shit. I twisted my ankle, but I guess I went down, like, the way I went down, it, like, everyone was like, we didn't know you fell. We thought you were sitting on the ground. <laughs> they were like, you just, like, you didn't fall. You're you, like, heavy. slowly <laughs> crumpled to the <laughs> ground. <laughs> it's because the world was spinning around her, so she thought she was falling a lot it, faster she like, than she was. Oh, okay, you're bottom gonna... heavy. You just landed. <laughs> you're fine. And <laughs> so Kyle was trying to help me up, and everyone else had gone up the steps because there's... So there's like a lower level and then you walk up the steps and then like you go. I don't know. There's more street. I don't know. Chicago's weird. But so we're all I'm sitting there and Kyle's helping me up. And then I look over and there's three people videotaping me. Oh, no. It was, well, it was, like strangers. No, it was my friend. Oh, OK. And then one of my friends, Emily, she had her flash on. So I looked up and I just see like a blaring like flash in my eyes. I'm don't like, go into the light. <laughs> definitely <laughs> videotaping me. And then Kyle helped me up the stairs. And when I finally got up, some guy that was standing there watching me get up clapped for me when I got up the <laughs> stairs. The whole street like, clapped. Woo! <laughs> but that was my only bad night. Every other night, I took it took it easy. Did you puke that night? Yes, unfortunately. Hey, that gets the alcohol out of our system. <laughs> it's also a waste of money. I yes know, I, and I no. I had fun. Yeah, we shouldn't have to pay that much to have fun. Like, just go have fun. I yes didn't and pay no. that much to have fun. I, get, I really I don't think ten, I paid that much. I there. can pay ten bucks, get more drunk than she did, and puke more. Where home? <laughs> Anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> 
the fuck are you drinking? Well, no, I looked at I looked at my bank account, and I don't think I spent that much. I think I maybe spent like thirty dollars. Good deal. Your friends got you drunk. Dollars. Yeah, I think so. Honestly, because I don't remember drinking that much. We did. That's have, what like, good friends do. They'll buy you drinks. Yeah, it makes you me so drink. happy to be going on the ret- my corporate retreat again in November to be with my coworkers because. That's you, what I want. Just to get <laughs> fucking so plastered with your coworkers? Yes. That sounds awful. I what? just told Mark earlier, that, like, the president of our company, who I told you guys, is like, she's does, she doesn't make you think of the people that would, like, somebody that would own a company like she does. But she was on the phone with Jessica earlier, just catching up, seeing how Jessica's vacation was and everything. And then Jessica, could, you could tell that she was about to get off the phone. So I was like, bye, Lisa. We love you. And she was like, love you guys. You could, like, hear her screaming through oh the phone. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. She's cool. I'm See, very excited to go I, on the corporate retreat again. I can get drunk one day of the year with my coworkers. What's that? Christmas party. Christmas party. Did you even get drunk though? I no, can get drunk. I had to drive. I can get drunk literally any day of the week, the year with pretty much anybody. Yeah, you like, can just get drunk like <laughs> He's like, I can get drunk like right now with your neighbor if you want. <laughs> yeah, I'll go, I'll go meet the Russian and fucking drink. <laughs> Oh, speaking you call of which, that vodka? <laughs> if you listened to last episode and heard the crazy story from there, that's up on the blog page on TF4. Yes. I posted oh, it. Nice. I posted you it. Post you put the pictures and everything with it? Everything yes. Sweet. Both of them? Yeah. Oh, my yes. God. So it's up there. And also, now that I'm saying that, too, you motherfuckers got to get some blog posts going on. Dude, I told you. I don't know <sighs> what to say. I, like, I posted I on there that I'm the only, I like the l- Vox, the lonely blogger, and like made a blog post about being the only person. Oh my blogs. god, <laughs> <laughs> that sounds even more sad than it is. <laughs> anyway, moving on I to another thing. Um, since we were talking about co- my coworkers a second ago, um, I've decided that I'm going to be trolling my coworker for a little while, um, and see how far I can get this to go before Jessica ruins it, because he doesn't <laughs> listen to the podcast. So today he made some comment about, oh, Jessica, Jessica said something and it sounded like she said Barry Allen and George is like, did you say Barry Allen? She's like, no, corrected what she said or whatever. And he was like, oh, like the flash. And I was like, who's the flash? And he was like, <laughs> Barry Allen. And I was like, I, okay, is that like a superhero or something? And he's like, yeah, he runs really fast. It's like, that sounds like a lame superpower. (laughs) (laughs) I hate you now, and I even know the truth. (laughs) That's really funny. That's awesome. We went on for like 15 minutes, and I was like. How irritated was he getting? He he wasn't getting irritated. He was just explaining it to me very patiently, like, who this person is. (laughs) Poor guy. And then he was like, yeah, you know, like, he's got his own show. I was like, he has a show? He's like, yeah, on Netflix. You've never seen it? I'm like, no. He's like, yeah, you know, like, Gotham for Batman and arrow for green arrow i was like who's green arrow <laughs> he's like yeah he's like he's like got all these he's like a rich person and he like fights crime and so i was like oh so he's like batman <laughs> <laughs> oh so he's batman that's what you're talking about yeah you know what you so, should, you so know it's what you going on said. for a little while i'm gonna see how far i can take it <laughs> you know what you should have said when he said the flash has a show on netflix you should, should have been like oh i think i saw it, it the one starring kevin bacon right Oh my god! The one with the blind guy, right? <laughs> the one with the blind guy, right? <laughs> what, what's blind Kevin? Guy? What one's Kevin Bacon? I might <laughs> flash dance, right? No, that's no. Footloose. 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 Who's who in flash dance? I don't know any big people that I are. I can't in remember who was in flash dance. I never saw. But that. I know what you're talking. I, 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 I get what to. you're saying, but yeah, that's still funny. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I tried. I fucked it up, but whatever. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> You've been Fine. on a roll tonight. Tremors. Mark. Tremors. Tremors. Kevin Bacon's. Yes. Yeah. Yes. That has nothing to do with anything. No, that's why I'm like, yes, Tremors. Speaking of baking. I had some. I had a free piece of bacon in my cheese roll up today. It was great. Yeah, everybody clap. From where? Taco Bell. They give me a cheese roll up. Where else do you get cheese there. roll ups at? What if you were a vegetarian? <laughs> oh, that would have been bad. Why would I be a vegetarian? I'm not stupid. What, but what if, if that had were, happened to a vegetarian? A but wait, why they does, need some bacon why in their life? Taco Bell have why bacon for their loaded bacon, loaded potato grillers. Yeah. I don't know. You wait, so know. when you say I got a free piece of bacon, was it just like a little flake of bacon? That it like was in one bite. Like, it was like this big. Oh okay. I actually bit into it the first time and I was like, "Woo!" And then I bit into it again. What's your question, bro? Oh, the question. Jeez, I'm just contributing everything to this episode, I'm, aren't I? I'm confused. What? No, actually, question. this isn't from this me. Is this is show. <laughs> this isn't from me. It's from Jessica. She, ac- I don't, I don't know where she found it from, but she asked us all this at the office. So. Um, Once again, Jessica is accidentally is contributing everybody. to the podcast yeah, and that she doesn't listen to. She's listened to hey, a couple the episodes. She lies. Anyways. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Liar. She's, she's listened to a couple. Tell her to quote us and then you can. <laughs> um, so if you won $30 million and your significant other was arrested and it cost $29 million to get them out, 
or they spent five years in jail, what would you do? Would you bail them out or would you keep the money? Peace out, bitch. Depends on what they did. Have fun. Yeah, if it's going to cause Give us you some t- content, Cara. Here's the, here's There's the reason. No con- that's it. That's here's my get. reasoning behind this, okay? If it cost me $29 billion, million dollars to bail you out of jail, <laughs> you did something serious that I don't want to be a part of. Bye. Love oh. you, but hey, dude, I'm going to be even- rich on my own without a felon for a wife. What if you're being like, what if it's like extortion and they're like, you can either give me $29 million and I can let her out or she can stay there for five years for this like petty crime that she did. It's just five years. You're fine. You'll come out. You'll come out. You'll come out tougher. He'd still leave me there. It's fine. I said I'd leave you too. That's fine. I'm like, you he would be mad at me if I spent $29 million. And it, it God damn like, right I would. It wasn't like, here, take five years to just like work out every day and do nothing. You're like, God damn right I would. I'd be so get pissed if you spent and everything, million. And then you come out and, hey, we've got $30 million. Fuck yeah. Sorry, $3 million. That was yeah. <laughs> I was going to say, you know you're going to spend most of that before I'm out. Oh, by the way, babe, we live in a mansion now. <laughs> this is Javier. He cleans our pool. <laughs> this is my boat. Also, I have some children here. Uh, oh. Would Javier, it's fine. Pool They're all Mexican. Would you wait the five years, though? Yeah, I'd wait the five years for Mark. Aw. Yeah. And I probably actually would put the money away somewhere. I'd probably get the house that we're talking about. Not not a mansion. I'd get, like, a decent house, but... It'd be, like, a ranch-style house. But I'd put the money land. away for him to deal with when he gets out. That was too easy of a question, because... Fuck yeah. You wouldn't bail me out, and I wouldn't bail you out. Peace so. out. Later. So... so would you so wait for me? Yeah, I'd wait for you. That's fine. Get a bunch of money, but I know I'm gonna go. I'll go on vacation for five years. She's gonna. She's gonna come back. She'd go on like vacation <laughs> for five years. <laughs> <laughs> no, t- well, Tosh, you're in jail. Tots gets out of jail. Out of world. jail. She's like, by the way, I like vagina too. <laughs> Fox, <is> like, yes. <laughs> I wish I had gotten a picture of your face. As soon right. As said that. <laughs> no. So, so it was like just us four at the office when she asked us this question, and then one more person came in for the day. So Destiny asked the the guy that was filling out paperwork the question and he was like oh it's i he's like i'd get her out like just like no question about it she's like you just get her out like no matter what it was and he was like he was like if you don't if you don't have the person that you love then what do you have to live for and she was like she was like oh yeah i'd leave him (laughs) she's like i'd leave him in jail and he's like but like what if it was like your mom and she she's like yeah, I'd probably still leave my mom in jail. Yeah, my mom can handle five years in jail. Yeah, so. my mom. Yeah, and you too. can give them money in jail for like. Yeah. My mom would be you a could boss. Spend way bitch less in jail. on getting a lawyer that could probably get them out of jail. Right. Right. That's true. Appeals court. Well, and you know anyone that is sentenced to five years or whatever, they don't serve that. Yeah, they get out on good. Get out in a year. You're yeah. fine. Good behavior. Yeah. Good behavior. My what mom, is the, my what mom if was the like jail was like Guantanamo Bay. Then I'd buy the then, jail yeah. and move forward. Set everyone that, free. Because that jail sucks. Yeah. And probably like make a sizable donation to the American military defense. And Hey, how about you nuke it and then just make sure you rescue that one person and yeah. then nuke it. Just nuke Tunnel it. Bay is not nuke it. nukeable. Why not? It's American soil. You can nuke your own soil. I'd rather they didn't. <laughs> This is the Trump supporting. But I mean, if it's Cuba, whatever. (laughs) (laughs) It is Cuba. (laughs) You can nuke that, too. They tried nuking us way back in the day. Uh, No, they didn't try. There was a Cuban missile crisis, and that was Russians missiles. (gasps) (laughs) You're (gasps) quitting. Knock it off, you (laughs) fucking conservative (laughs) asshole. Uh, did you back to a political podcast? Yeah. Hello. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Hello. We're back. The, Welcome to back around. The it's TFP fine. table for politicals. No, let's not. Table for pansies. That's Fox. Hey. Hey. <laughs> In stereo. Why stop that? You just, just got, got those nails done, yeah, and she's fucking with them. Biting. She's like, mm, well, I don't like. Did this you one. get a, a game lined up? We haven't done a game in a, in a while. Did I get a game lined up? What are you talking about? You said, do you want to play a game? I was listening to music in the car. And then no, you no. You said that won't work. And so then story time. What about the 8-bit? No, I don't have no 8-bit, and I'm not He's fucking with that. Okay, right let's now. let's um, play a game where everybody listens to Mark try and flip this Gatorade bottle onto its head. Mark, what was the game you say we play? <laughs> don't <laughs> Let's do turn out the lights and play Who's in My Mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Ew. Uh, it's disgusting. <laughs> I was laughing I'm really hard. That was good timing and I how quickly you responded. Right. <laughs> I tried to take a picture, but I spilled coffee on myself this morning. 
I was so uncomfortable. Was that this morning that that happened? Yes. yes. I, my days are all fucked up right Bucks. now. Like, I just keep thinking everything that happened today happened yesterday. Bunk said, do you guys want to play a game? And I instantly responded. I was on break at the time. I yeah, instantly yeah, responded, yeah. yes, let's turn out the lights and play Who's in My Mouth? <laughs> <laughs> and then, like, 15 minutes later, Natasha's like, that sounded so rapey. <laughs> <laughs> A little bit, yeah. That it's was not it's, a, it's a Dane Cook like joke, so of course it's kind of rapey. Oh, that's Dane Cook. I thought that was original. No. <laughs> no. What are you talking about? You've never about? heard that before? I don't like Dane Cook. Nobody does. Yeah. Mark doesn't have a ton of originality. He I don't think Dane Cook is original. You're, you're right. You don't think what's original? He has Dane a book? Cook? I don't think he's original. No. Oh, I thought you said that he has a book or something. Uh, yeah, I did too. I was like, I was amazed he knows how to write. It wouldn't be his writing. He'd just be sitting there talking to someone. It's an audiobook. Ghost it, doesn't, it doesn't have to be that it's a, an original joke, though. It's the execution. Exactly. Yeah, you're right. You're right. The, the comedic timing. Like you is died reading that joke, even though Mark reused it and Dane Cook got it from somewhere else, and yeah. it's just a joke. That's but it was funnier from your reaction than anyone else the first time Dane Cook did it. That's not true. I disagree. I don't know. I was taking a sip of coffee, and, and you said that, and I. <laughs> I, I love that you were taking a sip of coffee when I said I it laughed too. and it was hot and I was like, God damn, that's going all over my pants. It's going it down, down, baby. <laughs> you browned your pants? Were you wearing your brown pants today? Just on my, uh, like my hip area. No? Shame. Shame. Anyway, so no, no game? No, no game. What the fuck? Next episode, I promise. So no head? <laughs> <laughs> I got some bomb ass head last night. On your pillow? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I gave my pillow head. What is wrong with you people? That's how no, my da- the, that vine when he's on oh, the Oh, yeah, phone. your dad just said that to us the other day, I was didn't he? Say that my dad says that. I knew when that. He's going to bed. He says, oh. I'm going to go give my pillow head. Yeah, he does. I was like, why did that sound so familiar? Again, not an original joke, but. It's still funny. Funny. This, this episode's kind of a train wreck. I know. I, mean, I would have been like, you should have just stopped it there. Like, you should have yeah. just ended the episode there. I mean, we've had worse, but jeez, what's going on? But we st- I mean, we still technically we have like quiz. 15 minutes. I don't want a fucking quiz. Mm-hmm. We Ooh, can do it. Yeah, BuzzFeed we can do quiz. quizzes. You know how Fox loves BuzzFeed yeah. quizzes. That's what I was going to look up. Ooh. Um, I still think my game would have been better. Describe your, your ideal Thanksgiving dinner, and we'll tell you what superhero you are. <laughs> um, hey. So you guys have always bitched at me that I don't participate in games. That's why I was like, maybe this would work, but I don't, no one else could participate. It would just be me. That's why could nobody else participate? Stuff I, your face at a buffet, and we'll reveal which Chris Hemsworth character you should marry. Oh God! Yes. Fucking Christ! <laughs> yes. Um. No. You. You'd probably be able to pick up some of the stuff, and Kara would, maybe. But there's some obscure ass metal songs they come up on there. I'm not surprised. Yeah. So. Okay. If I say something and you want it on your plate, tell me. Oh, we're Mac- actually doing this. Yes. One. Mac and cheese. Yes. Mashed potatoes. Yes. yes. Roasted veggies. No. Yes. Potato salad. No. Yes. Caesar salad. No. Yes. Pasta salad. No. Yes. Stop saying salad. Sliders. Yeah. No. Yeah. I don't feel like shitting. Chicken nuggets. Yes. No. Are you taking Mozzarella all the boxes and answers? No, I'm taking both of them. <laughs> oh, okay. Mozzarella sticks. Yes. No. Corn dogs. Yes. Ooh. No. Hush what? puppies. Yes. yes. I love corn dogs. Spring rolls. Yes. No. Ribs. Yes. yes. Ribeye steak. Yes. yes. Chicken tikka masala. No. I don't even if you can't pronounce it. Chicken marsala? No. no chicken. T- it's like a Indian dish. No. 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 I don't Crepes. need that much curry. Cra- no. What the fuck? Crepes? Yeah. Wait, wait. If it's a breakfast buffet, sure. But mixing it in with a lot of that, no. No. Pizza. Yes. yes. Sushi. Yes. No. Tacos. Sushi. Yes. Yes. Chicken quesadillas. Yes. yes. Burritos. Yes. Penne. Uh, no. Pesto. I don't like no. pesto. Spaghetti bolognese. No. No. Fettuccine Alfredo. No. Yes. I hate fettuccine Alfredo. So do I. Disgusting. Lasagna. Yeah. Yes. Uh, yeah. Spaghetti carbonara. No. no. Spaghetti and meatballs. No. no. Licorice. Yes. Gummy yeah, sure, why not? Gummy bears. Yes. yes. Chocolate mousse. No. No. I don't like pudding. Strawberry cheesecake. I don't think you can no. fit a mousse on the plate. <laughs> Strawberry cheesecake. Yes. No. <laughs> donuts. Donuts. What kind yeah. of donuts? I don't know. A bunch of different kinds. There's chocolate sprinkles. Is yeah, sure. We'll take Is there a cinnamon one. roll in there? No. Damn it. That's not Red velvet not. cake. No. No. Pass Jello? this time. No. No. Tiramisu. 
No. no. I love tiramisu. Ice cream? Yes. yes. All right. Show me my results. Owen C. Owen Chase from In the Heart of the Sea. I've never even heard of that movie yeah, in my life. I don't know. It looks like it sucks. Does it look, does but it you look guys, really cute, though. All of your guys' options. It was like every option on there. Well, How about a would like you rather? Food. All right. Well, we kind of started that off. Thanks, Jess. Oh, so. wait, 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 wait. Before we do the would you rather. It's it's a would you rather in literally one category. It's all gross ice cream. You have to choose between the two. Gross ice that cream. That sounds awesome. Let's do that. Okay. What, what were you going to say before we do the would uh, you rather? I was going to say we can play Fuck, Mary Kill, too. Oh my god! That's actually with the other fun. three at the table. <laughs> That's what I was thinking. <laughs> oh my god! Let's not do that. <laughs> I'd fuck Mark. I'd I'd marry Tosh and sorry, Cara. Bye, Cara. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> hey, you're the one who said with the other three at the table. So I threw it's you fine. The I'd bus. fuck Mark and I'd marry <laughs> Natasha too. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, Vox. <laughs> you guys are mean. I'd fuck Tosh, marry Cara, but by Vox. <laughs> <laughs> Tasha. She's going to kill you, too. <laughs> I don't want to do this. <laughs> oh, I had oral sex with someone with the be- in the bed next to me, but I don't want to tell you who I'd fuck, marry, or kill. Wow. <coughs> awfully specific there, Vox. Okay. she do all three to Mark. Okay, you yes. go, you I mean, go, and I'll, and then have I have a... Have you seen this beard? I have a... bearded wonder. We got to get a fucking sticker made of, like, just a beard. Beard? of just a beard. Like, oh, I my try God, to it's just, just Mark. I'm down. Just, just digital the beard. And then we'll get um, glasses made for me. A booty for me. A big old peach big, for Natasha. A big old peach. <laughs> yes, like the peach emoji. Yeah, the peach emoji for Tosh and Kara. Nothing, because I'm not unique. <laughs> Lips. Jesus no. Christ. Lips. Have a, a little bit of confidence in yourself. Um, no. A pair of mangoes. No. <laughs> what? If she, if we're doing a peach for her and she gets mangoes, I want the eggplant. <laughs> <laughs> what do you get, Mark? Mark, you can have the pencil. Wow. <laughs> it's wow. your boy. Skin, skinny, skinny penis. penis. <laughs> <laughs> it's your boy. It's, uh, skinny penis. Well, God, we got to find something for Kara because I'm going to do this now. A pair of mangoes. No. No, that's offensive. No. Why is that offensive? But she gets a peach. Because she's got a booty. And she wants Cara doesn't that. have tits. And you guys mention my booty very frequently on the podcast. That's yeah, true. true. It, it is very, very pertinent conversation. She gets you like a notepad. A, yeah, a planner. A notepad. A planner. Thank you. Because <laughs> you're so organized. <laughs> oh, yeah, a planner. Okay, that's our mission right now. We need feedback from the listeners. What is Kara? What item makes what, you think of Kara? What item represents Kara? They don't see me. They just hear that, me. That's, that's exactly it. We've always said that the bearded wonder is Mark, even though we haven't really posted pictures of ourselves. And then there's like okay. bootylicious Tasha. The bootylicious Tasha. I just wear glasses. I mean, and I'm kind of nerdy. You're so a fucking nerd. Yeah, so that fits. I think yours should be headphones. I'd be okay You're with the it. sound guy. Yeah, I'd be okay with headphones too. Yeah, but sound master box. Mm. Bass man Vo. That too. Although you, know, you never <laughs> touch the Xbox ever. And I never touch Twitter. Anymore. So do you guys want to choose yeah, yeah, which yeah, yeah, ice yeah. creams ice you want to eat? Yes. But anyways, listeners, creams. help us out. Kara, yeah. we need an item. Hmm. Anyways. Next. Would you rather eat lobster ice cream or horseradish ice cream? Lobster. Lobster. Oh, no, yeah. lobster. Probably lobster. lobster. Yeah. I don't want spicy ice cream. Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah. Would you rather eat corn and cheese ice cream or mayonnaise ice cream? Corn and cheese. Oh, corn my cheese. God. Corn, corn and, and cheese. cheese. I'm nauseous. <laughs> <laughs> Just thinking of these things as ice cream is weird. <laughs> well, I can tell you, like, 35% of people chose the horseradish ice cream, and 28% of people chose the mayonnaise ice cream. So we're with the major- You're majority. With the majority. Way. Yeah. Ghost pepper ice cream or mustard ice cream? Mustard. mustard. With pretzels. Ghost pepper. Mustard with pretzels? Perfect. Have you ever had a ghost pepper? No, but ice cream will cool it down. No. Ghost no, pepper. You guys were in the minority not. there. Six, 36%. What? People don't like mustard, I guess. I don't really like mustard, but I might eat a ghost pepper. Uh, yeah, no thanks. Fish and chips ice cream or garlic ice cream? Garlic. Oh. garlic. Just give me the garlic. Oh, God. It's called, garlic. It's, it's called made by a company called Dracula, apparently. G- garlic. Oh, these uh, are real? Gross. Yeah, these are real ice creams. These oh. are the, the pictures of like places what that they're the selling fuck? them at. fuck? Yeah. Um, Who makes these and why? Yeah, and that was the majority, so you guys were with the majority on that one. Uh-huh. Uh, would you rather eat mac and cheese ice cream or insect ice cream mac and cheese with like the the dried little yeah but what's the flavor of ice cream that's holding the insect um 
It kind of looks like chocolate and strawberry. That's fine. Give me the I can insects. Deal with that. Yeah. I'll t- I'll take some pretzel chunks. What's it's the like other those, choice? It's like mac those and cheese. Dry, what do you call mac them? and cheese. What are those that's little dried a... things? The mealworms? Yeah, looks mealworms. Like mealworms. Okay. Oh no, that's gross. No, yeah, no, 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 no. You'd rather have mealworms because they don't have wings. If you're eating crickets, instead or something, of mac and cheese ice cream. Yeah, fuck that. I, I have can eat mac crickets. And crickets don't bother we'll go with the insects. That was the 13 percent of people chose that one. I'm not eating that mac and cheese ice cream. Are you fucking kidding me? Curry ice cream. Or wasabi ice cream. Oh my god! Wasabi. I think Mark just threw up in his mouth. <laughs> um, I think I'd have to do wasabi because cur- there's no fucking way I'm putting curry. curry. Like goes or not curry? curry uh, wasabi like goes away. Like the flavor is like intense and then it goes away. Yeah, curry is like burning. That was a close I'll take one. The curry. Fifty-five, fifty-five percent of people said wasabi. Forty-five curry. That Ugh. was pretty close. Haggis ice cream or octopus ice cream? Haggis. Oh my. Haggis. Haggis. Absolutely. Octopus. Haggis. Haggis Isn't that is like sausage. sheep brain or something? It's sausage. It, y- yeah. It's no. Ha- isn't haggis stomach lining? Is that what it That's is? That's what sausage is. Haggis is it's um uh, some organs in Stuck the in stomach, it. the lining of a uh, intestine. What was the other one? It looks really gross. If anybody wants to see the picture, now nah, let me like, see this. It's the one on the left. What? Where am I looking? Oh. I, yeah, oh it looks like God. Jesus it looks Christ! Like, I don't know, some kind of like peach-colored ooze all over it the place. It looks like someone vomited, froze it, and put it in ice cream. Yes, that's exactly what it looks like. And then I'll the octopus ice cream looks like vanilla with like chunks of octopus. Haggis, in please. You're going. No. You guys are going with Mark? haggis. Yeah, they no. Want octopus. Natasha, octopus. I'd say octopus. octopus. All right, I'm gonna put the octopus on here then. Yes, that was the majority rule. Like curry. But the majority, yeah, the majority picked the octopus thing. ice cream. And then pickle ice cream or fried oyster. Fried pickle. oyster, please. Pickle. Pickle. I'd go pickle. Oyster. I will vomit if I eat the pickle. 65% percent i probably vomit pickle. eating the oyster, too, but whatever. That was it. It doesn't give you any results. It's just a majority. Oh, man. My thing. stomach hurts now. Your that stomach hurts fucking wasabi that. curry thing. I feel oh. like we should go head-to-head, Mark, and try to do this music thing. I feel like you'd be able to do it. Yeah? I have a so? game, though. Oh, you have oh, a, you game? a game? All right. Tosh it's never a, does it's just a. It's not an actual game. It's another quiz. Well, no, for crying out loud. It's Fuck, Mary Kill. <laughs> oh, yes. Okay. All right. All right. Okay. All right. okay. okay. Amy Poehler, Tina Fey, and Kristen Wiig. I have to see these pictures because names. Amy Poehler, Tina Fey, and Which Kristen Wiig. Which one's Kristen Wiig? Kristen Wiig is the one from uh, Bridesmaids. That doesn't narrow it down She's whatsoever. She's the main, the main, the main character characters. from Bridesmaids. Still okay. not narrowing so it down I'm, for me. So I have this easy. You want to go around the table? I, think I, I know who I know who everybody is. I would. <sighs> I that's really hard because I love all of them. I, I think would fuck Amy Poehler, marry Tina Fey, and kill Kristen Wiig. Same. I agree one hundred percent. Let me see. Same. Sorry, Kristen Wiig. I agree one hundred percent because Amy Poehler is at least I'd funny. No, I'd yeah. kill Amy Poehler because I find her grotesque. Um, oh, that's I'd, harsh. I'd, I'd marry the shit out of Tina Fey though. I'd f- yeah. I'd probably fuck Tina Fey. Tina Fey's great. Kristen Wiig is act- I think she's pretty. Ew. So she I is. Would, I would marry her. She's pretty, she's but she's scary looking. I just think of her as that like what's her name? Gert or whatever. In that um I don't know. Saturday Night Live, not Gert. I don't know. She's that Oh, Gilly? Gilly, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Okay, Harry Potter, Edward Cullen and Christian G- Grey. Oh, super easy. Super, super easy. You Ooh. said Harry Potter. Okay, so I would marry Harry Potter. What? I would fuck Christian Grey, and I would kill Edward Cullen. Same. Let me see. I'd uh, definitely kill Edward Cullen. Definitely. Fuck him. <sighs> He's Fucking so ugly. Die. This is rough. Yeah, I'm going to kill is Edward. It? I'm going to... I don't know. Christian Grey, I feel like, would be fun to be married to because he's got a lot of money. Maybe. Yeah. yeah see, I'm with you on I that. I, I, I wouldn't want to commit uh, to that life. I'm I with you on that because I don't want to get bondaged up and fucked in the butt it's kind of so. it's kind of a, a dual thing though because if you're married you're what if i'm to... bondaging him and fucking him in the butt okay. that's maybe that's happen. okay maybe i can do that i don't want to get that grotesque with it you haven't watched it he's not a edward cullen's sense. dying i'll probably just say hi harry potter and christian gray just give me your money man so Wait. I'll, I'll marry your bitch ass and then kill you and you're gonna fuck whoa. harry potter whoa yeah. uh, i'm gonna hair tints. mark doesn't know what he wants to do i'm gonna this, this, the end of I'm this episode ki- just got let weird. Let me put it this way. I'm going to kill Edward Cullen. Okay. Good. Let me put it this way. That's 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 all I need to tell We're him. establishing that. Right yes. The, he dies. That's fine. Uh, I don't know. Like, go uh, back Mary, in time a couple years. All Mary, our friends are, like, Mary Harry Potter and fuck Christian Grey, I guess. No. Yep. One night, one night of that fucking Christian Grey weird shit, that's fine. There you go. Yeah, but Harry Pothead can hold, like, a, a dildo. He can literally, he can literally make oh. money. That's fine. 
I don't think that's a thing in the Wizarding it World. Harry has a good amount of money. He can, he's he's got also, a good money. He's also fairly rich, yeah. But I don't think he can just like... He, wait, you, he, he can maybe create he, muggle money if he wanted to. Like, no, so. I'm pretty sure that's like against I'm sure the Wizarding World. I'm sure there's a spell for it. Okay, anyways, next. She's taking this wig. Yeah. Monica, Rachel, and Phoebe. Oh, easy. Bye, Phoebe. You're dying. Yeah, Phoebe's Fucking dead. Fucking Monica marrying Rachel. Oh, my God. I'm no. the same. Um, I mean, what was Jennifer Anderson? Rachel. Rachel. Yeah, yeah. yeah Mary, I probably Mary that bitch. fuck Rachel and marry Monica. That's she I'd cleans. marry Phoebe, fuck yes. Rachel, and kill Monica. 100% that is right. You'd kill Monica? Yeah. You'd marry who? Monica's Phoebe. too bossy. You would. I, I believe that. Phoebe's ugly. No, she's she'd not. Ha- she'd not? have more fun with Phoebe. Yeah. Phoebe's weird. I just don't like her. Anyways, next. Let she me watch this show. interesting. Chris Pratt, Chris Evans, and Chris Hemsworth. Chris Pratt, Chris Evans, Ooh. and Chris Hemsworth. Marry I would Chris Evans, fuck Chris Hemsworth, and sorry, Chris Pratt. I'll I would, do the same. I'd marry Chris Hemsworth, I'd fuck Chris Evans, and I would kill Chris Pratt. Uh, see, this is difficult. <laughs> <laughs> it's extremely difficult. Chris Pat kind of annoys me. Because you got several man crushes funny. of Mark. I'm legitimately taller than all of them. <laughs> You're taller than me. Well, yeah, but yeah, you make it work. Uh, I guess I. Chris Evans is so wholesome, though. What What does that mean? Yeah. He's the kind of guy you want to marry, right? Exactly. That's why I married him. Yeah, then I, I can fuck him whenever I want. I think I'd rather marry Chris Jesus. Hemsworth, though. He's better looking. No, he's not. Rugged yes. handsomeness. Mm-mm. Yes. Though Chris Evans does rock that beard pretty well. Uh, but regardless, does. I'm killing Chris Pratt, even though he's the funniest. Aww. Poor Chris. Yeah. Sorry, Chris, Poor Pratt. Chris Pratt. Next. Uh-oh. Chris uh, Chris Hemsworth's pretty funny, though. Which Chris? <laughs> oh, did you just lose it? Ruh-roh. My app just closed out. Open oh, you have a BuzzFeed app? Yeah. Oh, my God. She's real hooked on it. Oh, God. You're hooked on worst. phonics. The next one was Jessica Lang, Angela Bassett, and Sarah Paulson. I don't know any okay, of those so Sarah, pictures. Okay, so Sarah Paulson is the one from American Horror Story. They're all, they're all from American Horror Story. Jessica Lang I don't know is... Any of them. I know Jessica Lang's the dark-haired one from American no. Horror Story. No? Jessica then I don't Lang's know who the any blonde. Of them are. I gotta see pictures. Yeah. They're, they're gifts, so you have to click the gift. To look yeah, um, watch them move and stuff. I know, we're gonna have to just... Can we kill all of them? Really? You're gonna kill all of them? I, I might kill Sarah Paulson, because I really don't think she's pretty at all. I'd kill Sarah Paulson... I'd probably bang Jessica Lang because I feel like she has experience. Even I need to see. Old. Can you can you share this with or, us, please? And, yeah, yeah. I was. And you're yeah. gonna marry Angela Bassett? I guess. Oh than, wait, it's Jessica Lang is it, it's in the same order, right? Yeah. Okay, so then I would probably out of those choices, I'd probably fuck Angela Bassett, marry Sarah Paulson, and I'd kill Jessica Lang. I I would fuck Angela Bassett, marry Jessica Lang, and kill Sarah Paulson. Mark's like trying to watch. It's like actually see past the word gif. Oh, I know who <laughs> Jessica Lang is now. Uh, She's the one who plays Sarah Paulson's mom in one of I'll the. I'll marry ones. Sarah Paulson, fuck Angela Bassett, and kill Jessica Lang. Because so she's Sarah old, Lang. right? Super old. Yeah. So I'm not and, into that. And her side. characters are creepy as fuck. Yeah. I feel like she's creepy in real life. All right, Jesse Pinkman, Walter White, and Saul Goodman. I know. I only know who one of them I are. I know who so. Walter White is. No. That's, that's about it. I would kill Saul. Oh, oh, okay. So, Jesse, I remember. I don't remember. I don't know what that Walter. Was. And then I don't remember the other guy. I don't remember. What about Jesse Eisenberg? One. Saul? He's the yeah. crazy attorney who ends up Okay, I'm going to kill money. Saul. Um, Probably Better. happened later on in there when I st- after I stopped watching. Better call Saul season one. I mean, I'll, like, season one is when Saul came in. I'll, I don't I'll kill Saul. I'll uh, fuck Jesse Pinkman, and I'll, I'll marry Walter White because he's smart. Um... I might go the other way around. Plus, yeah. he's probably gonna die. I think soon I'd too. have to. I, I think I'd have you. to fuck Walter and marry Jesse. Yeah, me too. Kill Saul. I'm gonna. I'm gonna marry Walter because he's smart and he'll probably die soon. It's fine. Okay, Emma Watson, Jennifer Lawrence, and Anna Kendrick. Fuck. Awesome. That, that's really <laughs> hard. Anna Kendrick. For Mark. Okay. Pin so. Perfect. Anna Kendrick, you hate. M- Mark is his see, favorite person. Okay, one more time. Emma what Watson. I don't hate her. She's Anna, my Emma favorite. Watson, Anna Kendrick, and who? Jennifer Jennifer Lawrence. Lawrence. Oh wow! <laughs> okay, so I know I All would right. marry Anna Kendrick. I'm marrying Anna Kendrick. I'd marry I'm Anna going Kendrick. to fuck Jennifer Lawrence, and I'm going to kill Emma Watson. Um, Two I think I would f- fuck Emma Watson and kill Jennifer I, I, Lawrence. Don't get me wrong; I, I think she's beautiful. I, I like I think her. I'd I like marry her Anna Kendrick, fuck Jennifer Lawrence, and kill Emma Watson. I'm with you. Mm-hmm. Emma Watson's too feminist. I she's love Anna Kendrick. Too serious. 
I just I don't really care. Anna about Kendrick's him amazing in everything she does. I love that woman. No, I gotta kill Kendrick. Fuck you. You would. I, I'm pretty sure that you said that you don't like her at all. I, I, her I don't mind death. her. I just don't think she's the tr- most attractive out of the. Everything about her, I love. No. no. <laughs> I'm going to marry Lawrence, though, even though she annoys me, too. But she's the prettiest of all three of them. So I didn't realize how annoying Jennifer Lawrence is until Ariana Grande did an impression of her. And I was like, that's so accurate. She's right. pretty obnoxious. <laughs> oh, I like she can her. be, she's but fu- I think she's, she's entertaining funny. as shit. I still, I still think she's hilarious. We watched yeah. the um, like a compilation of all of her Ellen appearances. Mm-hmm. And she, she is funny. I'll give her that. Yeah. She's very funny. I like her more on Jimmy Fallon because she just like she's not afraid to embarrass herself. Yeah, with Jimmy she does. Fallon. I don't think she Jimmy ever Fallon. is afraid to embarrass herself. Yeah, that's she's true. Just like fuck it, like I guess so I am. Yeah. Right. Okay. That's so most one. of these people, I only know one of these people: um, Idris Elba, Nicole Bahari, and Gadfried Gayo. What? I I know who Idris Elba is. Let's skip that one. He's gonna be the next James Bond. Idris Elba. I would marry him. Nicole Bahari. No, he's gonna be the next James Bond. It was a rumor. I don't at. know enough about all of them to really have he an tweeted opinion. And said Idris Elba is Heimdall in the I Thor think movies. I'd prob- oh, then yeah, I'd probably marry him. He died. Your thing shut down again. What? The and then I'd fuck Nicole and kill Godfrey I don't know who because Nicole I don't know who that is. is. Um, he tweeted and said that don't believe the hype. Well. Yeah, but they they haven't signed him. All right, Don't are we skipping that hype. one then? Yeah, that one's boring. I picked. You can pick. I uh, picked. I'm going to marry. Your uh, counts. I assume I want to marry the woman. I don't know. What does, she, what does she look like? She's pretty. Sure. I'm going to marry her. Why did they pick two help guys up. and a girl? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I'll kill the other guy. Okay. Ugh. Just getting back down to where we were. Alcohol, pizza, and Netflix. Oh, man. Alcohol, pizza, and Netflix. I'd probably have to kill alcohol, fuck pizza, and marry Netflix. I'll kill Netflix, marry alcohol, and fuck pizza. You'd marry alcohol? <laughs> it's more fun. You, have you a would problem. marry I alcohol. Think, I think I'd kill alcohol pizza. Alcohol will give you a better time marry in life. Marry Netflix and fuck alcohol. So, let me tell you. Alcohol is very similar to women, okay? You'll have more fun in life with them. You'll die sooner with them. And you can't drive with them either. That's <laughs> true. <laughs> God. <laughs> Dear Lord, you're right. <laughs> My dad always says tits and driving have are uh, two things that they contradict. One, if you have tits, you can't drive. Two, if you got a handful of tits, you can't drive. True. Okay, what would you do? <clears throat> I don't know, because up until recently, I hadn't been really an uh, alcohol Not person. Not recently. A year is a pretty year still recent. We've been dating for over a year. Well over a year. Yeah, and when did I start drinking frequently? About a year ago. So. Even not frequently. Like so he's saying that you've made him an alcoholic. Yeah. Not no. Alcoholic. <laughs> Basically. <laughs> Anyways, I really like Mac Jack. I really like Blake's. You know, I've had I have some wines and Grizzly meats pear. enjoy. Yeah, so that's actually really difficult. I Fuck don't like alcohol. I do Mary like pizza. I do like pizza. And I do like Netflix, but I feel like I'm going to kill Netflix. Yeah, I feel like I, I kill Netflix because there's so many things you can replace it with. Yeah, Hulu. Yeah, but yeah. I feel like I could live without pizza. I can't. Well, I could, but like if I had, if I truly had to give it up, I would give up pizza. That's why I don't I'm fucking know. pizza. Last I time I had pizza was like three weeks ago. I think I would kill Netflix, fuck pizza, and marry alcohol. Thank you. I'm I'm there with you because let me put it this way: Do I want pizza more than once a week? Usually not. Do I want alcohol more than once a week? Fuck yes, I do. And you know you're why? married to it. You don't have to pay yeah. it. Which and is it, why I'd marry Netflix, because I watch it every day. You watch Hulu more often now. Hulu's on my phone, though. That's why. It's on the Xbox, the too. One? Yep. Huh. Hmm. Anticlimactic. I could ask you guys 15 questions to figure out which Hannah Montana song is your favorite. Oh, my God. I already know which Hannah Montana why song is my favorite. Why can't we do something cool? If we were a movie, is my favorite. Because this is BuzzFeed. <laughs> I already know what which Hannah Montana song is my favorite. Yeah, I know you do. You know, the seven things I hate about you. Yeah. That's not Hannah Montana. That's Miley Cyrus. It's Miley Cyrus. It's the same fucking person. No, it's not. <sighs> oh, I boy. mean, the first question is, who is your favorite character on Hannah Montana? And there's Miley, Lily, Oliver, and Hannah. So L- there's two separate Lily options. Lily was super cute. Lily. Lily was super yeah, cute. Yeah, my favorite. I don't want to do this quiz, though. Stop <laughs> it. I know. Oh, nobody's going to know that one. It's what, what season of Hannah Montana is your favorite? The fourth <laughs> one because it ended. <laughs> Yes. We know which friend's character you are based on the Do KQB. something cool, like what metal band I listen to. Th- do you think BuzzFeed does anything with metal? I don't know, maybe. BuzzFeed doesn't do anything good. Or what What Dota character am I? There's like trivia, love, who are you, would you rather, food at Disney, and can we guess? 
Okay, That's hang it. on. I got. I'm. I'm getting one. Which? Oh, okay. Wait. Get one that has Dota. We know which quote from The Office you are based on your Disney options. Okay. Pick a Disney princess: Ariel, Mulan, Merida, Belle, Snow White, Tiana, Jasmine, Too many options. Aurora, or Rapunzel. Who the fuck's Merida? The red-haired one from Brave. Too many options. I just call her Brave. I can't handle a whole list like that. Yeah, Belle, no, I Ariel. Really don't like this. Belle or Ariel? Ariel. Vox, sure. pick. Belle or Ariel? Who the fuck's uh, Belle? Uh, the bitch who likes Beauty. to fuck be- bestiality oh, boy. I thought that was Snow White. Or girl. So we're doing mm. Belle? Sure. Uh, no. <laughs> yeah, we're Ariel. all doing Belle. Ariel. Hot Ariel? redhead. Ariel. Okay. Pick a Disney prince. The Beast. Prince Eric. Charming. Hercules. Hercules. But he's not, on not, here. A, he's not a Disney prince. prince. Philip, Aladdin, Kristoff, L- Lee Shang. Kristoff. Who? Kristoff. Kristoff. From where? From Frozen. Never seen it. He's the bad guy. No, he's not. No, he's good. He's That's the good one. Oh, okay. Never mind. Yeah, so I'm with Christoph? you. I'm with you on Kristoff. Okay. I don't know. Pick a know. Disney sidekick. Olaf. Flounder, Blue, Timon, Thumper, Miko, Jiminy Cricket, Mushu, Pascal, or Sven. Mushu. Mushu. The great and powerful Mushu. I'll say Mushu. Pick an underrated Disney movie. Atlantis, Hercules. Emperor's New Groove, Robin Hood, Lil- Lilo and Stitch, Hunchback of Notre Dame, Rescuers, Ratatouille, Meet the Robinson, and Hercules. Atlantis. Uh, mm. Underrated? Mm-hmm. Underrated Atlantis. is... what was? Go back to the top. What, what was, was the second Atlantis. one? Atlantis. No. Emperor's New Groove. No. Emperor's New Groove was underrated. Give me that. What? No, it's Robin not. Robin Hood, yes, it is. Rescuers, no. Hunchback... Lilo and Stitch. Lilo, Lilo and Stitch, Stitch is very underrated. Lilo and Stitch is super like underrated. I don't think it's underrated. Yeah, because Stitch is a bad guy who's a main character. So that doesn't mean it's underrated. Definitely underrated. He's not it's a bad guy. Hyped. Well, he has a redemption arc. Stitch. Are we doing Lilo? Fine, we'll go Lilo, Lilo and Stitch. Stitch. I love Stitch. He's so cute. Pick a Disney-owned franchise movie. Infinity War, Star Wars, Force Awakens, Star Wars New Hope, Black Panther, Rogue One, Ant-Man, Avengers, Solo, Star Infinity Wars, Empire War. Strikes Back. Empire Strikes Back. Technically not Disney. It is. So it is. you picked Disney Infinity owned, Wars. It's Disney I'm going to go with franchise. the Infinity Wars. Infinity? No. Empire is the best sequel of all time. You're not. You're Empire. outvoted. Empire. Fine. Kind of wrong. We'll go, start, we'll Empire. go with the Star Empire. Wars. Go with Empire. Fine. Pick a Disney Channel show. Wizards of Waverly Place, Lizzie McGuire. Lizzie McGuire. Phineas and Ferb, That's a Raven, Gravity Falls, Hannah Montana, Liv and Maddie, Jesse, and Sweet Life is Zach and Cody. Phineas Sweet and Life. Ferb. Phineas and Ferb. Wizards. That's the Sweet only one life. I watched off that no, one. Either, I'm either with Ferb. Sweet, Sweet Life or Lizzie McGuire. <sighs> okay, Lizzie McGuire. Phineas and Fer- Ferb is too new. Yeah. Sorry. It is not Lizzie. that new. One. Lizzie. It is. Go Lizzie. with Lizzie. I did watch that one. <sighs> Lizzie? Yeah, go with Lizzie. I could sing the intro to Phineas and Ferb. Because you're weird. Okay, I'm pick not. a former Disney star. Zendaya, Cameron Boyce. Demi. Cole Sprouse, William Brent, Bella Thorne, Tenzing Nor- Norgay Trainer. Peyton List, Francesca something, Jake Short. The only person I know on here is... What Thorpe. about Victoria Justice? She got naked. Okay. She so was Bella Thorne. Bella Thorne did too, yeah. Bella Thorne did. I don't Let's think go Bella Thorne. I, I don't want think Bella she's Thorne. pretty by any means. She's okay. I do. She's no. okay. Josh Dunn dated her, though. I think she is. Did I stutter? <laughs> is your quote. <laughs> oh, <laughs> lovely. <laughs> <laughs> Stanley Hudson. Yes. God damn it. I, I forgot what the goal so was there. I I, <laughs> okay. How uh, have you under, ever wondered what video game character you are? There you go. This one we can all. All right. Are you hyper? Yes. Not all the time. Kind of. Sometimes. Not at all. There's too much here. Not all the time. No, I'm not really hyper. Say not all I hate multiple. Like so many options. Like, give know. me like two, There's three five. options. And, There's and five. Stop. Relax. How many enemies do you have? Henchmen do not count. Different in every level. How are your henchmen? Different your in every enemies? game. Not a lot, but a few. Only two. The Flood and Covenant. Doctor Eggman. <laughs> this is too specific. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, huh? Only two. Only two. The Flood and the Covenant. Okay. <laughs> oh, calm down there, Master Chief. Yeah, but I didn't even play Halo. Do you? Pref- uh-huh, I totally don't get. Do what you you're prefer working right alone? Me neither. Me neither. Do you prefer working alone? I only work alone. Only sometimes with Luigi. Only Daxter, but all the time with him. I hate this. Occasionally a squad of troopers. I'm irritated by this. This no, is too I'm specific. Dumb. Stupid. I'm done with this. Stupid. Stupid, stupid. That was... I agree that that was stupid, we'll but take for the different buzz reasons one. than you two. Switching to the bud feed, BuzzFeed one. The bud feed. <laughs> bud feed. <laughs> Let's see if bud feed is an actual website. Oh, I'm sure it is. Oh, God. She was a controller, and there are way too many options. It's literally every game console <laughs> controller of all time. I hate BuzzFeed. Pretty much. Choose a controller. PS4. Or wait, is there a mouse and keyboard? 
No. Okay, the N64 controller. What's your greatest strength? Respectful, honest, passionate, humble, focused, confident, brave, likable, sexy. Honest. Sexy. Honest. Go fuck yourself. You suck I can this buy game. the domain for budfeed.com. Good for you. Budfeed? <laughs> <laughs> that can be our new website. <laughs> 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 we call it. What's your greatest weakness? Distant, stubborn. All right. All of us are stubborn, right? We're all stubborn? Yeah. No. We're all stubborn. Not that stubborn. Yes, you are. Nuh uh. Apparently, I'm stubborn. <laughs> Shut up, Tara. If you say you're not stubborn, that means you're stubborn. <laughs> <laughs> With the options are distant, stubborn, selfish, unassertive, perfectionist, impatient, pushy, always late, Oh, you didn't say selfish was an option. <laughs> We're all stubborn. perfectionist. Always I'm not late. a perfectionist. What's your guilty pleasure? Shopping, Netflix, snap- snacking, rom coms, wine, Facebook lurking, napping, BuzzFeed, chocolate. BuzzFeed. I'm not on BuzzFeed that much. Netflix. You have an app for <laughs> it. <laughs> I have an app for a lot of things, though. So. What, snacking. Bitch? Snacking my... A- Maybe you're right. <laughs> <laughs> Might be snacking, too. Were you going to say snacking but my ass? Yeah. <laughs> 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 oh, God. <laughs> you farted? <laughs> Who farted? <laughs> <laughs> Whoo! Shit! <laughs> you know how you know something's really funny. Is Mark starts laughing like Elmo. <laughs> he farts. That's how. Huh? I'm mocking him. Next. <laughs> Next question. I'm dead. I'm dead. It's fine. I'm okay. <laughs> uh, what's your guilty pleasure? Nobody. Nobody decided. We need one. I'm Netflix. Do a quiz. Wine. I don't have my phone on. Wine. Me. We'll say wine. <sighs> Choose your weapon. Okay, it's like literally every iconic video game weapon of all time. There's the Master Sword. There's a hammer. There's the Magnum from Halo. A green shell. Bow and arrow. The uh, Missile Command base. An egg. Is there a blue shell? A barrel. And a magic wand. Is there a blue shell? No, no blue shell. Uh, blue shells are great. Well, blue shells are cheating, so... No, they're not. Yeah, you only get it because you're losing. Oh, shit. I just unplugged my headphones. Way to go, jackass. Pick a weapon. I don't know. Just uh, Green shell. Green shell. Ooh. Pick a sidekick. Tails, Cortana, uh, female Diddy Kong, uh, a dog, <laughs> dog meat, uh, Tinkerbell. Dog meat. Uh, companion cube, uh, Kazooie, Luigi, or Diddy Kong. Diddy Kong. I have no idea what the question is anymore. I Pick a sidekick. Oh, sure. Diddy Kong. Or Tinkerbell. But, but Tinkerbell. Dog meat, though? Tinkerbell. Fine. Tinkerbell. At least I think it's Tinkerbell. It's probably the, the fairy from Zelda, but whatever. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm picking dog meat. Who do you hate the most? This quiz sucks. Wow. You haven't even given it a chance. This it's is why this is why Natasha and I do quizzes. It's I know we man. get the good quizzes, Sucks. <laughs> like the good dumb quizzes. Yeah, the ones that we played were fun. All right, Vox, who do you hate the most? Silence. He oh, this know. one, this one will be fun. Oh no, these uh, I don't know. I don't play any of these games. I found wow. a good one. Let me see. I want to see it because you didn't say anything. Is that Bowser? And when do you have? Um, that guy, that's, that's an evil person from Eggman. Zelda. I don't know any of these things. Let's go with the ghosts from, from Pac-Man. The ghosts from Pac-Man? This is the longest quiz. What, what are the names life? of the ghosts? Lara Croft Pinky. is the video game character we are. Pinky, Inky, Dot, and what's the third one? I, don't know. I thought it was Blinky. Stinky. Blinky. Blinky. Blinky is the third Stinky. one. Pinky, Blinky. Inky, and Dot. Inky, and Dot? I'm probably wrong. You sure that Inky is right? I don't think Inky's right. I don't know. We get a fucking phone. Google it. Our answer was Lara Croft. <sighs> oh, my Lanta. Fuck Lara Croft. How well do you know 1950s slang? Well, no, Mark don't. Mark's ending this here. He's picking up the... <laughs> <laughs> what is an ankle biter? A dog that bites your ankles. Literally a chihuahua. A kid. I, no. A child. A child? Yes. It's yeah. A it's definitely a child. <laughs> it is. Yay. <laughs> What's worse than a what rapist? Does cut, what does a cut child. the gas mean? Slow down, be quiet, stop drinking, or two farts. What is what? Stop Cut drinking. the gas. Slow down. It means stop drinking. Are you lying? No, it means stop drinking. Or slow down. Cut the gas? I don't fucking know. Nope. It's be quiet. Oh. Well, what that's is, stupid. What is a flutter bum? An attractive woman, someone who's fast, someone who's unreliable, or an attractive man? Unreli- attractive a woman whose butthole is open. 
Uh, oh, what? A flutter bum? She's yeah. got butter, butterfly wings tattooed around it. It flutters. When she what is a flutter bum? Uh, un- unreliable. Woman. Unreliable. I don't know. An attractive man. Oh, that's stupid. Why? This, which, this quiz sucks too. Which one of these is a passion pit? A band. Where's the band? Or any the bedroom. Of the bedrooms. It's a bedroom. 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 Why not? Nope. It's a drive-in theater. Stupid. Uh, read, um, the, who, read the bugs. Who would be considered a frame? A cheater, a liar, an outcast, or a gambler? I don't know. I have no fucking clue. Never heard that you word. Say in a my gambler. Life. Nope. It's an outcast. Advertisement. In the 1950s, you said. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I guess. More well, like ni- wha- 19 boring. What are you when you're <laughs> frosted? Drunk, angry, high, or tired? Cold. Drunk. Drunk. Angry. I'm fucking frosted right now. <laughs> frosted. So fucking frosted at you. Which one of these is a rag top? Uh, it's a car it's with a, car a soft thing. top. Yeah. Yeah. Rag top. Rag rag top. top. That's from What does uh, made in the okay. shade mean? B-O-B. Success Bombs is great. Guaranteed. guaranteed. A made sketchy in the situation. Shade. Something manufactured cheaply or being really lazy. I have no idea what the question was. What What's is made, made in, in the shade? shade? <clears throat> Something made it really easy. Yeah, sure. S- success is guaranteed. Who made will you call daddy How many questions is this? There's two more. Give up. daddy was a guy. I did give up a while <laughs> ago. A guy friend. A father, old person, your friend, or a policeman? Your friend. daddy It is. Okay. One more. How would you tell someone they're very attractive? You're fucking gay. You're a big tickle. You're absolutely... <laughs> <What the fuck>? <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> Read that first one again. You're a bit. You're the bi- Oh, you're the big tickle. What the that fuck? That's so much kind better. What kind of ass <laughs> vibe is that? You're absolutely <laughs> bazzers. What? You, you're quite the rattle tat, or you're the ginchiest. I let's go with the. I you're hate. the big tickle. <laughs> yeah, let's go with that. You're the ginchiest. The fuck, gingiest? Ginchiest. Got a problem, bro? We got three out of ten right. <laughs> Seems like you've made a real goof of it. Maybe you need some peepers to help you see better. Maybe BuzzFeed can go fuck itself peepers. and stop doing <laughs> stupid <laughs> quizzes. <laughs> fucking BuzzFeed. Get oh, my God. One sponsor I never want, BuzzFeed. I want BuzzFeed to sponsor us. Yeah, a million dollars or shut the fuck up. <laughs> so uh, that's going to wrap it up because we're tired of BuzzFeed. At least Vox and I are. Uh, so please visit our website at tf4podcast.com. You can listen and download episodes, check out our blog posts and updates, as well as some tidbits about us. You can also find our episodes on your go-to podcast apps, including iTunes, Podcast Addicts, CastBox, and Podbean, pretty much everything except Spotify and iHeart. Please subscribe and leave us a review and rating, and it's a great way to help support us for free. It goes a long way towards promoting us and helping us gain popularity. You can also find us on Facebook by searching for TF4 Podcast. We post weekly updates and, s- and share episodes. Drop us a like to follow us and stay connected for when we make new posts. What was that all about, Carl? <laughs> uh, if you're interested in owning some of your very own podcast merch, check us out on Redbubble. Just go ahead and search TF4 Podcast. Uh, we've got mugs, cell phone cases, um, some other stuff. Stickers. That's what the other thing's in. And possibly dodos. We don't know yet. We'll figure that out. Mm-hmm. Uh, <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> Car is trying to grow a beard with a microphone. Oh god! Now you're making noise with it. You done? <sighs> yeah. Anyways, anyways, check out Redbubble. Uh, a portion of the money you pay for the items there go toward us and help support us directly. And then, uh, the merchandise is pretty cool, right, Car? Yeah, it's out in my car. I meant to bring it in today to show you everybody, you but didn't. it's out in my car. Okay. But the mug's pretty Damn cool. It. It's pretty handy. Uh, and then we finally have a YouTube launched. Uh, most of our future episodes will appear there. Everything after episode 27. You're going to yeah. see 28 and up. Uh, Valk is uploading this, those when he gets the chance. Check those out. They'll probably, uh, if you're following us on the blog page, you would have saw that um, they'll probably be uploaded a day before the uh, episodes go up. Most days. Because I'd like to get them made on Sunday because I schedule the posts for Monday. Okay. So I will make the video and I will upload them automatically to uh, YouTube. So if you're following us on YouTube, you might get access to the the episodes on Sunday. Yeah. And if you happen to pay for t- YouTube Red, then you can might as well just use YouTube and listen to our You stuff can might as well just. Eat shit. <laughs> Anyways, finally. 
If you'd like to support us financially, uh, if you like us that much, you can check us out on Patreon.com. Just search for TF4 Podcast. Uh, we have a variety of uh, reward tiers there where you can give us money. And in exchange, we will send you awesome stuff and shout you out at every every episode or you know every possible And you get on the we website. Get. Yeah, and your name's on our website and post it up there under supporters. If you'd like to check out who's supporting us, just go there, TF4Podcast.com slash supporters. At least I think it's slash supporters. Yep. Whatever. Yep. You'll find it. Uh, but anyways, uh, shout out to Dustin and Steve. Thank They're you. They're our patrons. Thank patrons. you. Yeah. And uh, we hope you enjoyed this episode. Love you guys. This is episode 32. We didn't even mention that this whole time. Jesus Christ. It's 33? Jesus Christ. 32. 30 32. I edit them. <laughs> you do, but you've been wrong Yeah, before. he listens to them like 12 times. I do not. This is... Uh, Episode 32. Yeah, yeah, it was. By the way, why did you not name our last one? Listen, we're 32 episodes and we still don't have it's our vulgar. shit together. Episode 30, 31 should have been Go Fuck Yourself. Why? What was up with that? <laughs> we, we were talking about getting dildos with the logo on it. T4 That's so vulgar, Go fuck though. Yourself. I'm not going to put that. <laughs> I think it's fantastic. I, I don't disagree with you, but it's still pretty vulgar. I kind of want to get a dildo and put our logo on it. Now. Good God. Okay, love you guys. Bye. Bye. Oh, wait, we have to. Oh, yeah. Bye, I'm Mark. Bye, I'm Clara. I'm Natasha. Okay. Okay. Box is in box. Okay, bye. 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 bye.